Hello gardening friends, this is Rosina Newton and I'd like to talk to you today about what you can't see in the garden and how that can help you. First of all, compost is our friend. Many people use compost and it makes the difference between a garden and a very good garden. If you add compost in the beginning, it does have beneficial microorganisms which help to fight disease and make nutrients available to the plant on a consistent basis. So it also helps to hold in moisture for the summer and it has many other benefits that you'll find out when you add it. A vegetable garden might need up to 50% compost added to a soil the first time and then add some every year. The microorganisms could be bacteria or fungus. Most of the time we think that this, these are bad microbes, but there are good microbes and bad microbes. And when you add the good microbes to the soil right off the bat, then there's not enough room for the bad ones most of the time. That's no guarantee. But that's a first step to a very successful garden is adding a good quality manure compost. The next step might be if you're planting a tree or a shrub or even flowers is to use mycorrhizal fungi. Mycorrhizal fungi actually live on the plant roots and extend out from the roots and make a bigger root system for the plant enabling the plant to uh, get more moisture from the soil and in the trees example this is one that you might add to the the hole before you plant a tree and it extends the root system reaches out ahead of the roots to find water and to make way for the tender little roots coming out then um, these are others that you can use for flower plantings and general plantings mix into the soil before you plant to add those mycorrhizal fungi then let's say you've done all this but maybe there's a disease lurking uh, this is a disease control product that actually uses a bacteria to fight disease, many different kinds of disease, diseases. So this is called Serenade and it is something that you can spray on the leaves and using the bacteria fight fungus and other bad bacteria that cause spots and many different things. It has a whole list of diseases on the back that it will fight and that's quite amazing that it has the, uh, the audacity to list all of those diseases that it can fight. Then for prevention and for cure, Actinovate is a product that's actually made in Houston, Texas, and it is a bacteria also that fights diseases, but also improves the root system, which is a lot of the cases these beneficial microbes can um, can fight diseases and help to improve the growth of a plant. So this one is often used with controlling take-all root rot in a St. Augustine lawn, also used to fight some foliar diseases. And then for prevention and, um, and also to help green up a lawn or plants that you're planting in pots or in the ground, you can mix in this product, which is Actino Iron, made by the same company. And it has that same bacteria mixed with iron, and it's in a safe form that you can use in an organic garden. All of these products are very helpful um, in the garden. Always remember that if you're using organic methods, then you're not harming the beneficial life in the soil, and that's the best way to keep a healthy soil, is not to harm the life that's there already, and add to the life in the soil by adding compost, mycorrhizal fungi, and then preventing diseases and such with the disease control products that use a beneficial microbe. Thanks for listening and enjoy your backyard.